Hey, listen, we are back. And uh, it's, it's great because in this crazy day of travel, and I mean just today with everybody trying to get down to the city from the North Towns, it's amazing that Wendy Merkel got here from Room to Spare Storage because still there's people here who haven't come into work today. But <laughs> Wendy is here, and Wendy, Room to Spare Storage has a great Christmas message for a lot of folks out there who are getting ready to ship packages. Well, you know, the funny thing about packages is that people, a lot of people just do it once a year. Yeah. You know, and for all of you grandparents out there, if you have a grandchild seven and under, I'm sorry, you have to send them something. Yes, you do. And if it's closed, you better put some candy in there. Yes, you know I agree. I mean? Just saying. So I can save you a lot of money. I mean, the dirty little, dirty little secret is. Okay. okay. I'll say it. Go ahead. Is that the Fe FedEx office and the UPS store have a, a close to a 40% markup. Oh, wow. They do. And I, you know what? I ship FedEx at my store, but I don't mark it up that much. And the reason is because I've shipped a lot of things that I sell online, mm -hmm. and I have a patent on an item that I ship all over the U.S. So I want the deal myself. So I mark it up a couple bucks to pay for the guy who's got to stop. I have a very significant shipping business. It's really funny. I mean, people come from, from all over Western New York to ship with me because it's such a significant savings. And so what I say to people, if it's... If it's between three and six pounds, it's who you like best, okay? <laughs> okay. But six pounds and up, you actually absolutely should bring it to me. Three pounds and under, little something, something, you can go to the post office if price is your only concern. I bet you don't have the lines at your place like I you do don't. at the post office. I don't. And I have two um, registers, if you will, and we just crank it and out. And you have the shipping paraphernalia. Yeah, so all you have to do is really bring the item into me. Isn't, just it, isn't that the best news you've heard, like, just, all just day? Just walk in with it. And, and, I mean, say, like, Wendy, I, I don't know. It's, I, it, it's fragile. I don't know. And I had a they're going to take in. care of everything and get yeah. it out. With a Cheaper. boat. With a giant sailboat last week that had, and nothing came apart. And she's like, I, 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 and I'm like, I got this. So, <laughs> we print and make our own bubble wrap. Oh my God! No, so every, yeah. Tell everybody where Room to Spare Storage is. We are on Transit Road in East Amherst, mm -hmm. or north of North French and south of Millersport. Um, I got a big LED sign out there, so um, just look for that and uh, come on in. Understand that um, you don't have to wrap it in brown paper. As a matter of fact, that's a bad idea. I'll take that off. Mm -hmm. uh, that I don't care. Things, like yeah. the post office really cares that the box is plain. As long as it doesn't say anthrax inside, <laughs> right. I really don't care what it says, you know. And with today's weather, there'll be nobody online. It'll be great. <laughs> so, um, Isn't yeah. That great? So, That's great news to yeah, know so that there's a shortcut it. here. It'll be cheaper, and she'll do all the work for you. And all you got to do is take it to Room to Spare Storage. I mean, that is like, get out there and start shopping, folks. Because, that, you know, so the shipping part is what keeps a lot of people from saying, well, I can't do it. The other thing is, you know, a lot of people don't understand, you know, does FedEx require me to have a signature or not require me? Can it, right. Does it ship on a Saturday? Look, I know all the ins and outs yeah, of all of that. All the and a lot of people will say, um, okay, I have to ship it with insurance. It's not insurance. It's called declared value. And what that means is that's the amount you are saying to the shipping company that you can't sue them beyond. Okay. All right. I tell huh, people don't put money into the insurance, put or the, the declared value, put money into the packing. Okay. We yeah, have never sense. in 17 years lost a package. And listen, not only that, but when you're there with Wendy, talk to her about Kelsey's art career because right now her daughter Kelsey, who's an incredible artist, she won down at Allentown a couple years ago. She every can year. create a portrait for you, yeah, every year. <laughs> and uh, that'll be a unique Christmas gift. So there's, there's still time to do that. Wendy, thank you so much. Good luck getting home. Good luck because now people are going to be heading to Room to Spare for their shipping. And by all means, do it. 636-4620 or just simply log on to roomtosparestorage.com. We're out of time. Don't forget Pickler and Ben coming up at 3 o'clock. Careful in the snow, everybody. Have a great day.